Diane Reham is an American public radio talk show host. Her program, The Diane Reham Show, is distributed nationally and internationally by National Public Radio. It is produced at WAMU, which is licensed to American University in Washington, D.C. Personal Life Diane Reham was born in Washington, D.C. to an ethnic Arab family of Greek Orthodox Syrian background. Her parents, Wadid and Eugenie Tsuiki, had originally lived in Mersin, Turkey along with their extensive families. Eugenie had briefly lived in Alexandria, Egypt with her family before marrying Wadi and moving to the United States to start a family with him. She attended William B. Powell Elementary and Roosevelt High School in Washington, D.C. Upon graduation, she was employed by the city's highways department, where she became a radio dispatcher. She never attended college. Diane married John Reham, her second husband, in 1959. John Reham died June 23, 2014. She has two adult children, David and Jennifer. In her autobiography, Reham said she had been molested at the age of nine by a congressman whose identity she has not revealed. Career Reham began her radio career in 1973 as a volunteer for WAMU's The Home Show. In 1979, she took over as the host of WAMU's morning talk show, Kaleidoscope, which was renamed The Diane Reham Show in 1984. Reham has interviewed many political and cultural figures, including John McCain, Barack Obama, Madeleine Albright, and others. She has said that her most touching interview was with Fred Rogers of the PBS program Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood, conducted just before his death. Reham considers her interviews with Bill Clinton and Hillary Clinton to be amazing experiences. She has written two autobiographical books. The first, Finding My Voice, dealt with her traditional upbringing in a Christian Arab household, her brief first marriage and divorce, her 50-year marriage to John Reham, raising her children, the first 20 years of her radio career, and her battles with depression, osteoporosis, and spasmodic dysphonia. Together with John Reham she co-wrote Toward Commitment, a dialogue about marriage, which was published in 2002. Corporation for Public Broadcasting Report, in 2005, a private study funded by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting said Reham booked 22 liberal guests for every five conservative guests. The study was criticized as a politicized attempt to, in Reham's word, scare journalists with the accusation of liberal bias. One criticism of the study concerned its criteria of what constituted liberal Euro a category which included seemingly moderate Republicans such as Senator Chuck Hagel and former Representative Bob Barr. The study was commissioned by Kenneth Tomlinson, whose appointment to the chairmanship of the CPB by George W. Bush had been criticized by liberals as politically motivated. Tomlinson hired Indiana consultant Frederick W. Mann, a conservative thinker previously associated with the Young Americas Foundation, which has described itself as the principal outreach organization of the conservative movement. A report on the study by the CPB's Inspector General, Kenneth Combs, criticized Tomlinson's methods. The report led to Tomlinson's immediate resignation in November 2005. According to the Washington Post, Diane Reham herself called Mann's findings unprofessional and simplistic, and added I've been booking shows for 25 years. I don't think they have any idea what it takes to achieve the professionalism and expertise and the right people to express a variety of points of view. What, Kenneth Tomlinson is doing, I think? is trying to scare public broadcasters. Documentaries, Reham has been featured in three political movie documentaries, Jimmy Carter, Man from Plains, I.O. USA, and Inez Soz's 2016, Obama's America which used her quote, and then you've got the cover of Forbes magazine, a cover story by Dinesh Tsuza. I think nothing has turned my stomach so much in recent years as reading that piece. Honors and awards, a partial list of Reham's honors and awards, 1999 Washingtonian of the Year by Washingtonian Magazine. 2000 Fellow of the Society of Professional Journalists, honoring extraordinary contributions to journalism. 2003 Calvary Women's Services Hope Award, honoring her volunteer and professional work for women in need. 
2003 Montgomery County Chapter of the National Organization for Women's Susan B. Anthony Award, honoring her advocacy of women's right in the community. 2006 Urbino Press Award, 2009 Peabody Award, 2010 Fora Mother Award for Lifetime Achievement from the National Research Center for Women and Families, 2013 Access Arab American of the Year, 2013 National Humanities Medal, References External links, Diane Reham at the Internet Movie Database